Hi everybody, Jeremy here from Video Editor Studio and today I'm going to share with you how to do a burnaway transition in DaVinci Resolve. Let's check it out. Alright, so in DaVinci Resolve right now on the edit page and I have two clips in my timeline that I've shot for a music video a couple of months ago and I'm going to use them uh, to show you how to do that transition in between those two clips. It's going to work pretty well because uh, the two clips have a dominance of red color and it's going to match with like a fire transition. So we're going to go over to the effect library, go down to video transition and here we're just going to scroll down to burn away and we're going to just drag that and drop it in between the two clip so now if we play it we have by default a transition that is applied now we can modify this transition by going over uh, to the inspector you can extend the transition or reduce it uh, we're just gonna leave it uh, like that and then you can go down to effect burn away right here and start to adjust the look of your transition here in motion you have the choice between uh, three different options you can do uh, directional which is basically uh, one line and then you can move uh, the angle around and uh, you will have a transition that go either from left to right or uh, from top to bottom uh, so on and so forth you can choose from hotspot which is basically uh, gonna start from the brightest spot of your image so the animation is gonna start from a spot in your highlight you can choose to have either uh, a lot of spot or uh, just one or two uh, you can also go to path and here it's basically uh, gonna give you two line that's gonna create uh, the transition and path is basically two line that's gonna create the transition we're gonna go with path because I think it's the one that looks the most organic in my opinion uh, then you can go down to adjust timing if uh, you wanted to adjust the timing of the transition if you want it to start earlier or to start later you can uh, do that right here so you will have basically the transition going uh, quicker or slower at different parts, you can make those timing adjustments right there. Then in edges here, you can adjust the roughness of uh, the edges. You can have here something that is a bit more rough and uh, random, or you can have just a straight line if you want. For this one, we're gonna go for something uh, quite smooth. So I'm gonna bring the scale uh, to the maximum. And here I'm gonna bring the richness to the maximum too. Then you can adjust the melting. Uh, I will recommend to leave it uh, like that. Same for the char. The char is basically uh, the black part that you see around here. You can choose to have a specific color and you can choose uh, how much do you want it to appear on your screen. Right now we're gonna put quite a lot of it and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna change the color and pick the color that we have on screen uh, to help it blend uh, on my image. So here, I think I'm quite happy with that. I'm gonna click OK. And then here, burn is basically the thickness of the line. So I'm gonna make something that is very thick. Don't worry, we're gonna adjust uh, all that pattern right here and make it look a bit smoother. You can adjust the color of your line. For this one, we're just gonna do red and uh, we're gonna just bring the saturation down a little bit. Then if you want, you can adjust the brightness. For this one, we're just gonna leave it by default. And here you can add some glow so we're gonna add uh, quite a lot of glow and we're gonna add a little spread to it and maybe a bit more glow and here we got our transition it's just a starting point you can do a lot of things with it in my opinion and you can just create a bunch of different look uh, it's very nice to have this tool directly from the edit page i hope this video was helpful don't forget to like and subscribe and see you in the next one bye speed up your workflow and create better videos using the pack available on our website including titles transition and templates but only for DaVinci resolve get started today by downloading our free starter pack containing a compilation of 20 titles created from our library link in the description below or at videoeditorstudio.com.